On this video here, we're gonna call from a lady. Actually, I've done, I've cleaned some, I did some work for her, cleaned some of her outside condensers, and uh, she got a unit on the second floor. I guess she's selling the house, and there was some water in the secondary pan. Uh, I probably should have went up there and checked it, but I was busy that day, and I didn't, I didn't get up there to check that part of the system. But anyway, I go back there, and um, you know, this guy, this guy from the, uh, the, the the home inspector wants me to go over there and. Uh, you know, give it my one or give it my blessing that the system's, you know, guaranteed to last 150 years or whatever. And I'm not going to do that. I'm going to go there and if the drain's backed up, I'll clear the drain and I'll do a video of it, what I do. They can make their own decision. I'm not being liable for anybody's old equipment. Um, you know, it might last a day. It might last, you know, 10 years. It might last, uh, you know, two hours. I don't know. There's no, my crystal ball are left at home, so... We will do a video of the work. We will send them a copy and let them, let them make up their own decision. I didn't see any mold in the system. Uh, I took the cover off. I cleaned the evaporator. I blew the condensate line out. It was blocked. So, um, I'm just leaving that job now. The condensate line was blocked. So, we blew that out with uh, the gallo gun, a couple of CO charges. We dumped some water down in the secondary pan. Uh, the main pan, it, it wasn't backing up, the water was going down the drain, so. The secondary pan had a little bit of rust in it, but I scraped it and I could see galvanized down the bottom, so it's not rotted through. Uh, it's holding water. So that will evaporate. You know, like I said, I'm not being held responsible for any old equipment. I go there and do the best I can on what I got to work with, and that's it. It is what it is. Let the home inspector make up his own mind what he thinks. That's his job, not mine. Alright, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Alright guys, I got the unit off here. Coil cool, don't seem to be dirty, and the unit does not seem to be have any any black mold at all on it. So there was water in a secondary pan, but I leave. I believe this drain is backed up, so I'm gonna cut this and blow it out with my gallo gun, and then we'll pour water in this pan and see what happens. I believe the water is, is not going down this drain. And it's backing up into the secondary pan. So I do have some water here I could dump in and check it. Let's do that. I'll give you guys some shots as I go here. Seem like there might have been a blockage in there. We'll try hitting it one more time. Hit this way quick. We know that's clear. Alright, we're clear. Right there. I'll never leak. Alright, now 
what we'll do is I'll put water in this pan and we'll see if it drains down. Looks like that pan's working the way it's supposed to. There's some water in the, underneath of it, so it was probably just a block drain. Mm. You see the water's going down the drain. Yeah, you can see it. You can see it where the water is going down the drain. see any I don't see any black mold anywhere so that's a good sign looks pretty clean the evaporator is pretty damn clean too I can take it apart and brush that evaporator off but you guys make your own decision this pan should dry up No leaks on that. If you don't have to get it apart, you can just pop it apart. That won't leak like that. We'll brush the coil down with my coil brush. It's not bad, but I'll brush it down anyway. see the new black mold in there everything looks pretty clean so you make your own decision this drain pan will dry out it's not rusted on the bottom you can see it's galvanized down there you can see it's galvanized underneath so it's not bad Seems to be okay. Oh, are you serious? Blockage in the line going out. I don't see anything at this point. Um, I ran water down the pan on the inside. And it seems to be taking it. Nothing's backing up here. And like I said, I'm doing a little video. And you guys make up your own mind. I'm not uh, guaranteeing nothing. Would you, would you say that you did not see mold? Yo, you're going to see in the video. I didn't see any. I did a, I'm doing a little video for you. And you guys can see what I see. So obviously I dumped you know, a couple of gallons down it and it all went down the drain. I was holding water in the pan. If that pan was cracked, it wouldn't be holding water. So um, we blew this line out this way, going outside. I think that's what the problem was, the blockage. I didn't see any mold. 
and the visible mold. I cleaned the coil. I think they're ready. You know, you guys make your own judgment. It's an older system, but it seems to be, you know, for the life of the system, seems to be in decent shape, as far as we could tell, as of today. This water should evaporate inside this pan here. ADP heating coil on this side and evaporator coil on that side. Well, you can see that that joint will never leak there. I do that all the time. That's fine. <clears throat> That's where the line goes down right here. This is 